Okay, today I just want to talk to you a bit about hard water. You know, what is it? Where does it come from? Um, I'm coming from my experience with this is I, uh, I work at a municipal water treatment facility. Um, I've been there for a little over 10 years. And uh, a lot of the customer complaints uh, is due to hard water. So I thought I'd um, uh, explain, you know, what it is and where it comes from. So uh, here it goes. It's very, very simple. Uh, hard water generally is just minerals dissolved in water. That's That's all it is. And uh, primarily, it's uh, it's calcium. This is shown as calcium carbonate right here. Um, but that's most of what the hardness is is calcium, and uh, it's dissolved calcium in the water. And a lot of it too is is like the metal magnesium, uh, as well as uh, iron. Iron is uh, very common as a component of hardness. Um, and most of these three together make up hardness of water. So what's the problem with these uh, with hardness and water with the calcium and the magnesium and the iron and some of the other things? Uh, well, first of all, it's not health related. Um, hardness is actually um, good for you. If you look at your uh, multivitamin pack, you'll see that, um, or, or your multivitamin pill box or whatever kind of multivitamins you take, you'll, you'll see that a lot of it is, uh, there's a lot of calcium in it. Iron and mag magnesium are, are, are some of the, the vitamins and nutrients that your body needs. Um, and it actually gets a lot of this from water. Um, the problem with hard water is you get um, a lot of hardness buildup. So, you know, you, know, you get um, like that white, so scummy stuff in your bathroom and spots in your, your cutlery if you're going to run a dishwasher. And, and soap scum, basically the, these minerals um, react with soap uh, to, uh, perf to, to make up the scum. And uh, the soap doesn't get used for its primary purpose to, to clean. Uh, so that's that's the issue with the hard water. Uh, so some examples. Um, this is uh, some you know calcium built up on your um, your bathroom tiling. Uh, water evaporates, leaves the calcium behind. Here's an example of of some rust stains from from your water uh, in the bottom of your tub. And and here you can see uh, again some calcium built up on your uh, your uh, sink and, and, and faucet from evaporating water leaving the calcium behind. So where does it come from? Where does all this all this stuff comes from? Well, uh, it comes from the hydrologic cycle. What, what happens is uh, the water starts off in the ocean, it evaporates, and basically evaporation, it's, it's like water distillation. Um, pure water comes up off the ocean, it evaporates from you know heat and whatnot, um, goes up in the air, and it condenses, and some of it falls back into the ocean as precipitation, but some of it uh, starts coming over land. Now, moisture can also come from land, from uh, lakes or rivers or whatnot, and, and, and evaporate, as well as uh, vegetation, trees, grass, uh, whatever. Uh, part of respiration, part of them breathing, part of us breathing, uh, is uh, giving off uh, water vapor. And a lot of the water vapor comes from, from natural processes, so it goes uh, again into the air and and basically it, it forms clouds and, and precipitation snows and, and rains uh, and basically what you do is you get what what's called this infiltration right here uh, this infiltration a lot of water most of our fresh water actually goes into the ground um, and uh, it flows through the ground until it you know f it gets into lakes it gets into back into the ocean and even and and basically also a lot of our water comes from wells that are that are sunk and as as this water Water, uh, is going through the ground. It's, it's going over uh, rocks and, and, and whatnot, limestone and, and iron deposits and, and metals like magnesium, maybe some sodium. And that's where it picks up because water without uh, any uh, minerals in it, uh, it's very, it's, it's like a sponge and it'll soak up whatever it can get. And so basically it gets uh, it gets all these minerals and, 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 and uh, hardness picks up from the ground. Um, and that's where hardness comes from. And that's it. In the next presentation um, that I do, uh, hopefully you stick around for that. Uh, it's, there's I'm going to talk about methods to remove hardness and, and how to stay healthy, how to enjoy soft water, um, and how to also enjoy the benefits of the calcium and other minerals in the water when you're drinking cooking. Uh, so for more information, if you'd like, uh, please go to www.truthofwater.com and uh, there's uh, information there and you can also uh, uh, click on a, on a button, fill out a form, ask any question you want, I'll answer whatever questions you have. Uh, and that's it. Thanks and hope to see you again.